Hello, Matt from Brooks Bricks back again with another video looking back at some building mocks that I've done previously to the start of my YouTube channel and today I wanted to profile the little town library that I built. So let's have a look at that. And starting with a look at the front here, the look that I was going for with this building was to be kind of a former uh, industrial style building that was converted into something much more community friendly. And the, the basis for this building actually was these um, large pillars here, these very industrial looking um, pillars. And I've got them on both sides of the building. Those basically give it, I think, a very industrial look. And then everything around that was almost in a way converted to be more of a community friendly, um, very nice looking, style of building. So let's have a look around the outside here first. So you can see in the front, um, we've got two floors on this building with a small 3D sign, library and kind of an indication of books on both sides here and then a sign down below as well. And have a little rotation around. Let's see here. And you can see the both sides look basically the same. We have uh, basically blue shading here. And it, the differences in color, I, I like the difference because it kind of indicates that at one point it might have been one color and then they painted over part of it. And you can see here on both sides those posts going up and down. And then I blended the look right around here, especially in the front with this additional piece, this slope here that curves into it. And I really like how that blending looks. <clears throat> and then around to the back, and see, <clears throat> originally the idea was that this would have been much more plain and just closed up, but the idea, particularly with the second floor, is that they demolished some of the wall and they put in more windows for more light and more aesthetics. And around to the fourth side, again, you can see it's very similar to the previous one, with the colors and the blending around the sides and top here. But overall, I really like how that looks. And then back to the front here, and let's have a look inside. Okay, so with the roof and the second floor removed, let's have a look inside of the building. And here we go. You can see on one side here, it looks like we've got the main circulation checkout kind of services desk. And we've even got a librarian in here taking care of some stuff. And I thought it would be really cute to include a coffee maker or maybe some kind of small service thing for, as well. Maybe it's just for the patron or just for the staff, I'm not sure. Look at the checkout computer that they've got. And a basket for some materials and of course some circulation materials right there. And then there's a little cabinet underneath, underneath there. There is a table for a patron. Over here is actually a laser jet printer for public use. And then a stack of paper next to that. Let's see if we can get in here and look at the printer a little bit more. I did not come up with that idea myself. I did Google that and found a really great design from somebody else, so I do not claim credit for it, but I love the design. It looks very much like what I view as an HP laser jet printer, and I love to integrate that right in there. So that's one side of the building first floor. Of course, then we can see a stairway going up here to the second floor. And now what I like here is I also included a large kind of a study, just group area on the first floor here. A couple of tables for people to use. You can see a waste bin over here. And being a tech person I am, I absolutely had to include a couple of public use computers on the first floor here too for patrons. Pretty generic, but you know, it works. And then there's just a small lamp for some aesthetics over here right by the stairway. Now let's have a look from the windows to see what that looks like. You can see inside there a nice view of the common area, group study area. And look through the doorway here. And then a look into the service desk. 
Pretty neat. And let's have a look at the second floor. Okay, and here's a look at the second floor. This is the circulation you know, collection area, and this would be more of a quiet area compared to the first floor. So starting over here, we can see we got a couple more tables around the uh, staircase area here for some quiet study and group work. And then we've got some shelves with books and other materials. And then a display case. And around the other side here too, another bookshelf with a bunch of more materials and a table with a bunch of books on display. And then just a quick look around the front side around the staircase. Very basic look, but I think it gets the idea across that this is a library. Let's have a look inside through the windows. And rotate around the back here. And again, the idea being that this was formerly a small industrial building that they converted into a public library. But I think it actually gets the idea across really well. I'm pretty happy with this design overall. So that is the Brooksville Library. I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more awesome videos from me. Thanks and talk to you soon.